Hello, everyone. Good evening, if, if that's what it is, where you are. Uh, good morning, where I am, actually. Uh, all is well. It's so great to see my fellow uh, guru brothers and sister uh, uh, sitting around here on this very auspicious, I mean, blessed day, I would say. It's a day with, when Abbaji and Razia uh, departed and uh, uh, We've been celebrating over 21 years. This is the 22nd year, and we hope to continue, you know, uh, paying respects and claiming a connection with this incredible uh, uh, lineage. Uh, so, uh, but before we go any further, I would like to offer from all of us and from the world of rhythm, uh, you know, my condolences to the family of the great legendary phenomenal Birju Maharaji. He just recently left us and, and to, on the 4th of Feb tomorrow is his Salgira, his birthday. So it is important for all of us to remember him and pay our respects and our salams to him and uh, wish him best for his onward journey. And he's of course with us, will always be with us and uh, will be a source of great inspiration and influence on what we do in in our future. So uh, to keep that in mind, I'm going to ask Tony G, my lovely wife and uh, my musical partner to uh, do a little uh, presentation of, of Nritya uh, Kala, uh, vis a vis bowls. So, so, carry on. Yes, first of all, I must acknowledge that in a few hours in New Delhi, uh, all over the world, people will be gathering family, Maharaj's beloved family, those near and dear to him, his beloved disciples, students, well wishers, to celebrate his birthday. We had to always have the mercy. So on 4th, we couldn't go to Delhi. So um, Maharaji, as you all know, I don't have to tell you what a treasure, legend, icon, true Renaissance man he was. During the first COVID year, he sent out a challenge on Facebook. Maybe some of you saw it. You know, and we always say you, human being cannot approach perfection, but it was such a beautiful little nugget that I wanted to share it. And so many dancers took the challenge and danced, including family members and many dancers. So I, I'd like to recite it because right. it's been in my mind. It kind of made me, lifted me up in these dark days. Very simple, short. I'm getting a little delay here. <coughs> which, which is my channel. Okay. Yeah. As you also may know, uh, we have just celebrated my Guruji, Sitara Devi, Katak Queen Sitara Devi. Uh, her 100th birth year, and we have just mm. finished that, and all year, Jayanti Mala, and many, many, many dancers, artists, singers, well-wishers, um, uh, uh, along with uh, Jayanti's husband, uh, they have put together an incredible body of work all year, and um, so I'd like to begin with a shlok that Guruji taught me, and uh, because I think we'd like to start, Zakir and I wanted to start with that. We all need the blessings of the mother, um, especially now, to release us from the fear and sorrow we've been going through. And um, Abaji, you know, played many, many times with both Maharaji and with my Guruji. And uh, he was one of the great artists who accompanied dance along with being a great soloist and 
accompanist uh, for instrumentalists and vocalists. As, and then, of course, Akir has carried on. Um, so Guruji danced at Zakir's first birthday, Maharaji danced at Zakir's fourth birthday, both times accompanied by a bhaji. So there we go. Go ahead. Da din din da, din din da. Din da din da da din da din da da din da din da da din da 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 din da din da da din da din. Da 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 pay da 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 na ga cut da cut da da cut da 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 cut da digi da cut da cut da digi da cut da cut da digi da cut da cut da 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 cut da do ga no na to da da chama cut da chapa da da mi mi si da ma cut da kar ga kap par chama cut da door ge door ge tan asi ni sura sura da la mala shumba shumba ni shumba ma da la tan ka buvna me rahi buvna tri buvna jay te jay 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 te jay sura sakala ni ra bai ga na ga va da da la day 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 ma da. That's good. Thank you. Thank you, Tony G, for uh, for an auspicious beginning. Thank you, Tony G. Now. Uh, to get uh, the tabla uh, session on the way, I would like to uh, uh, begin with uh, uh, one of Abaji's senior most students, uh, Nishikant Barodekarji. He couldn't join the group the way it's been set up in Mumbai because he's he's in the south, and uh, and uh, so he will begin, and then uh, we will have the group join us. This is a very interesting experiment that. Uh, a bunch of my guru brothers and sister are in Mumbai in a studio and I'm here and and including Sabir Bhai or Sarangi Maestro he's there and and then we're going to try and interact uh, everyone is going to do a little piece and then I'm going to play and Sabir Bhai is the constant who will keep Lera and hopefully even with this much distance between us uh, everything will remain in time and you, you, the listeners who are watching, uh, will be able to hear everything in one uh, unified sound uh, in real time. So, um, uh, Nishi Bhai, uh, pranams to you. Pranams, Happy birthday Lucky to you. Bhai. And, Bhai Lagi. Um, and uh, my loving pranams to Akbaji and all my Guru Bhai over here. You know, that we miss her very much is my sister Razia. She's the one who passed away in the afternoon and my father followed her in the in the night and uh, and i guess he wanted to be with her through that difficult journey to the next life and then so uh Rastia is also remembered uh with fondness with love and uh she'll always be in our heart so nishi bhai pranams and uh, pranams. over to you thank you zakir bhai bhai lagi my humble offering to Abbaji and uh, my loving Sairams to all my Guru Bhai and everyone watching. Is that the Thos Akhil Bhai? Yes, but let's see. Hazri.
thank you nishi bhaiya thank you for the uh, performance and 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 starting shri ganesh of the of the of the morning uh, uh i i cannot thank all my brothers and guru brothers and sisters enough for being there in memory of abba ji and supporting our family through all these years and and uh, and carrying his name his knowledge his vidya forward and uh, so some of you are here and and it and i want us all to be able to share uh you know the 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 talim that we have received there's um uh yogesh bhai yogesh samshi ji who, who's uh, there uh, and i'm um, with our family uh, uh it's it's fazal bhai tofik bhai myself yogesh bhai we are all you know family we are brothers and aditya kalyanpur he is family and 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 we have one lone sister in our group mm -hmm. uh anuradha paul and uh, so it's great to have her it's like having uh, you know this whole you know my father had seven brothers and one sister so you know it's somewhere in in that in that neighborhood so uh i don't know what kind of order do you want to go in uh i believe uh that there is i really can't see Aditya first. Aditya first, then Yogesh ji. Yogesh, then me. Then Fazal ji. Anuradha. Then and Anuradha ji in pink, and uh, and, and then Taufik Qureshi ji in chair, and uh, so he's chairing the whole uh, evening. Taufik Qureshi ji. Okay. I'm tabling. <laughs> tabling. Okay. It. So and and you know the the one of the most important feature that's going to keep all of this together, the glue that ties are all together. is sabir bhai who is going to be playing sarangi and he's somewhere there as well uh, so this again is an experiment and we are hoping that we'll be able to uh, thank you sabir bhai uh, make this happen and uh, so april is is a very interesting month uh, it's uh, uh, it's not april yet but uh, my father's birthday ali akbar khan saab's birthday Ravi Shankar ji's birthday, Sultan Khan sahab's birthday, Khan all birthday. is in mm -hmm. all are in April. So and all have been very important influences in our lives, and uh, so Sabir Bhai is is a connection with that influence. So Sabir Bhai, Bismillah.
यही प्रॉब्लम है थोड़ा मेरे लिए भी छोड़ना
Which one?
Hello, everyone. Hello. I have no idea what happened at the other end. Does anybody know? We are still here. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, did, did the music work? Did, did we actually play I, together? I, I, I think we did. I think, I think it worked. I think, I think, it, think worked. it worked quite well. Yes. We actually okay. played together. For, cool. Across the seven uh, seas. For me, the sarangi kept cutting in and out. So I was not quite sure what was going on with the tempo. So that's what was happening. But apart from that, it was great. Uh, I have to thank Aditya Srinivasan. There are three Adityas here today. <coughs> but AS. One too many. <laughs> On all, all our behalfs, I want to thank Aditya Sahi Asan for uh, you know, coming from Chennai and sitting here in the studio in Mumbai, not here, but in Mumbai, and making this all work. I thank Tony Ji for starting, it, uh, starting us off really well, and Nushi Bhai and Aditya Bhai and uh, Yogesh Ji, Padal Bhai, Anuradha Ji, and Ki Kureshi Sahib, so all of us, I, you know, we don't get a chance to get together. I haven't gotten together with you guys in oh, oh, two plus years and and we all miss you very much. But Abaji brings us together. He is the glue that ties us all together. And, uh, Absolutely. and I have to say that, you know, one thing that I learned from him was that first learn from the core material that you have and how to develop that core material before you go any further. So that's why I played two compositions in there which were from his Dhadin Takritikra and it was just development further on it, learning from the core and then see if I can get enough information as to how to put things together by doing that and then moving <coughs> forward. So uh, I hope you know, I know every one of us has done that. We've taken the source material, expanded on it, and then developed our own language with it as well. So, uh, you know, the older generation uh, sitting over there, you know, amongst us, Yogesh Bhai, Padal uh, Bhai, Taufik Bhai, should say something about Abhaji uh, uh, and Anuradha Ji and Aditya Bhai, that, and, and then Nishi Bhai. So, if it is possible to just get a line or two in about anything that you feel about him or are feeling about him right now, it would be good to have that happen. So, let's begin with uh, Yogesh Bhai. Uh, thank you, Zakir Bhai. Uh, please do or... it in uh, Safed Do, huh? in D. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I could do that. <laughs> well, at first, thank you so much for uh, making this happen, bringing us all together. But I know you said Abbaji is the glue and uh, yeah. he brings us all together every year at this time. Mm -hmm. uh, when I reminisce about Abbaji, all I can remember is his state, his, his meditative state, completely immersed in the time cycle, com completely immersed in uh, his own rhythm and uh, from there on uh, the whole world of creativity that he would be in and at any given time of the day anybody who visited him uh, never left without being given something uh, in terms of uh, wisdom in the world of rhythm mm -hmm. uh, that's how I saw him and uh, that's how he was uh, all those years that I saw him. And I think that's a great blessing for us for, uh, for having been able to see him that way because that's what created the atmosphere around us and engulfed us uh, with all that knowledge and wisdom. So my Sashtang prana Pranams to his feet and all of uh, our... we, we pray that he keeps blessing us all. Thank you. Uh, <clears throat> lost to say, but uh, uh, at this moment of time, it's uh, 
difficult to uh, put a budget together in a few words. <laughs> mm-hmm. There's so much to it and uh, it's so many um, aspects of it. Uh, it's uh, besides, uh, uh, you know, um, tabla, there's so many other aspects of his, his singing, basically. And I remember there a lot of these dinners that we used to go to uh, Zakir Bhai, you were never there <laughs> because it was those dinners which and included uh, everyone going to. I remember, uh, it, was it Shivji's house or was it Hariji's house or something? Having dinner there and Abbaji taking the harmonium started singing and Shivji accompanying him on the tabla and Hariji on the flute. <laughs> so these are the things that uh, uh, stays glued into our minds because that shows the other aspect of Abbaji's. Uh, personality mm-hmm. just not being a tabla player but you know something that uh, uh, connects with the other part of his and then of course I remember that concert with Zagir Bhai you played where he sang the uh, uh, all, all the old composition at Xavier's College and uh, mm-hmm. you, you played the tabla with him and 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 Sultan Khan Sahib on the Sarangi and mm-hmm. giving us the the uh, idea of Patiala Gharana of mm-hmm. his you know so that that is one of the other uh, thing that uh, always comes to mind and and of course uh, he's sitting there and watching a cricket match <laughs> with all yeah. of us sitting <laughs> uh, in, in the in the hall and he's he, he loves to watch the the cricket matches that that was going on you know that uh, these are the other things which is uh, <coughs> made it a little easier for us to deal with him because uh, as as a guru he you know it was uh, uh, very difficult to tell him to uh, repeat a composition again <laughs> because you know he's a guru but then you have the other aspect where he's, he's sitting with us and watching a cricket match and uh, singing away to glory about his uh, uh, singing a ghazal or a thumri or something you know and a totally different aspect of uh, his personality coming forward you know so there are so yeah. many things that you uh, learn from all this that uh, being a complete musician is, is an important aspect of uh, uh, doing anything. So I keep telling the students also, you know, not learning tabla is enough. I mean, learn some vocals so that you get an aspect of how to accompany somebody or how to, mm-hmm. um, you know, uh, play a tabla solo as per, uh, as per accompanying somebody. You know, it's not just mm-hmm. uh, playing something. You're given a chance to play and it's not like two concerts happening on one stage, but a combined concert uh, together, you know. So all this right. p- part of learning that... Uh, stays uh, in our head. Yeah. Tofik bhai. Uh, 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 Abhaji, uh, like Fazil bhai said, and even Yogesh bhai, that you know, it, it's very difficult to define or describe him in a few words. But yes, uh, he was a man, he was a malang. Uh, and even when he would sleep, his toe, leg toe would keep the beat going mm-hmm. in his sleep because he was calculating, doing compositions in his head. And yeah. that's an amazing thing to see that, you know, he's sleeping, but his toe of the, the big toe on the feet mm-hmm. is going in time. That's so that shows that somewhere he was connected and the yeah. compositions were constantly on. Dhati cricket on the hand and cricket on the TV. It was going on. Cricket, <laughs> cricket, cricket. <laughs> so good. that was going on. And I remember when, whenever we would sit and learn with him uh, playing, a boss, obviously he would play and we would play. And if we, if we would repeat anything, he would say, don't repeat like a parrot. Try uh-huh. to create something of your own. I have given you something, you make something of your own over there. And I think that yeah. opened our minds because that made us not to copycat, not to repeat, but mm-hmm. to always keep everything here. And one other thing which Yogesh also knows, he's he's experienced it, that don't write any wo- any chakradars, tukras, paltas. Keep it in your oh, head. Yes. And I think that, wrote, that, that yes, no book. <laughs> because are you going to sit on stage with the book? And I think that increase that GB capacity in our brain because to keep everything in mind and not write. So I think I, I, we should all thank Abhaji for that because yeah, we still absolutely. don't write and play it. <laughs> so these are just a few things. Thank you. Thank you. 
Uh, uh, Anuradha ji, you want to say a word or two? Like everybody's saying, it's so hard to speak about Abaji because he is a, a, a saint. I think uh, somebody who really, really means a lot to me and to everyone around here. Um, but talking about cricket, I remember something very uh, nice. I was seeing a match with Abaji. And, uh, you know, that was so absorbing and he was so involved. And uh, Ammaji stepped in and she said, Are, abhi cricket se... Kirkit se dhirkit mein aayye khaan sab. So, and that was just so, you know, so, you know, amazing about him, the, the kind of absorption, the total oneness with music, uh, with that eternal something that he wanted to always be in search of. And mm. uh, it's so inspirational because when a person is so absorbed, so... Uh, involved in his work that nothing else matters and uh, the uh, absorption is so uh, great and like uh, you know I just want to narrate a small incident I, I went to play with him in Kolhapur uh, and after the concert the next day uh, you know Sultan Khasab and uh, Amaji Abaji and uh, I we went to the airport and uh, the flight was cancelled and uh, he was very upset about that. And he said, uh, Chalo, abhi jaldi se gaadi arrange karo nurada. So I went and the first car I could get was this Omni, this uh, which I could get. And uh, so both of them sat in the Ammaji and Abaji in the back seat and Khasab in the front, Sultan Khasab in the front and the driver. And there was no place for me, but I was sitting on the ground uh, of, the, of the Omni. And he was in a really bad mood because... Uh, he was upset about the flight cancellation and the long uh, road travel that lay in front because, you know, 15, 16 hours traveling from Kolhapur. No, so, so he said, uh, so I just asked him, I said, Abaji, wo, uh, I uh, heard uh, Zakir Bhai playing with uh, Ali Akbar Khasab in Savai Gandharva, uh, eight and a half beats. So, uh, can you please tell me what you will tell me, how is it, how is it, how is it, how is it. So he said, uh, so immediately he shot back, <laughs> so I said, Nahi, abaji So because I knew that was the only way to get him back, you know, he was, uh, and so he started uh, with eight and a half, and then pura matlab peshkar kaide ek ke baad mein he was just rattling it off one after the other. It was like unstoppable. Then he went to five and a half beats, then to six and a half beats, then to seven and a half. Then he said, "Acha, abhi gyara matra sunne suno. Abhi dekho gyara tera ko aise khulte hain, pandra matra ko." To I, that entire 15, 16 hours of journey from Kolhapur to Bombay, he was on a roll, just continuously teaching, continuously, um, sh you know, creating. Uh, on the spot and it was just so inspirational and mm. uh, just uh, all I can say is that we're so grateful to have had a guru like him to have been blessed by him to have been taught by him because I think he uh, you know he was a man always in search like simply even when we were w once I remember we were coming out of the class and we sat outside there and uh, I think Yogesh Bhai was also there in that. And he came out and he, there was a chopali that he, he, you know, after the class, he would sit outside and have a limka and smoke his cigarette and uh, cool off uh, after the class. <laughs> and uh, suddenly, he, uh, this chopali came to his mind and he started to sort of recite it. And the Amaji had come to the, uh, you know, she had come from Mahim to pick us up, uh, to pick him up. And she was waiting on the other side of the road at Kettle Road, you know, Shivaji Park. And so suddenly some student came running, ke, aye, aye, Amaji aa hai, to jaldi aye. So now we, cr we were crossing the road and Abaji was unstoppable there as well. The same chopali continued while we were on that divider waiting and you know somebody is there and somebody is here and then that whole speed and then we went opposite and he still continued Amaji was waiting very patiently in the taxi Ara chalo ji, chalo ji. And he said Ruko, pura khatam hone do. and the entire chopali finished we said it and then he left. <laughs> so that was his incredible commitment to teaching to sharing and I mean, I miss him so much and uh, God bless his soul and I thank God for 
all that he has uh, given me. Thank you, thank Anuji. You. Aditi, a short word from you. Uh, Aditya. As, as all of you know that, you know, Abhaji, I was very blessed to have shared a very, very close bond with him since uh, my, you know, early days as a kid. And what I really learned from Abhaji, apart from all the knowledge and all the wisdom and all the bowls and the love for tabla was also a way of way of life and uh, how to love your tabla and he always said ki jitna tum tabla se pyar karoge utna hi tabla tumse pyar karega mm -hmm. and uh, and and just a way of life i mean you know his his humility uh, his divinity I mean, it's just uh, words fail me here to talk about him and uh, I get very, very emotional because um, I, he was really like a grandfather to me and uh, we shared a very, very close bond and I so miss him and uh, I, I really owe a lot to him because through him I met all of you, uh, Zakir Bhai, Tony Bhabi, Fazal Bhai, Tofik Bhai, Yogesh Bhai, Anuradha Ji, everybody, uh, through him that I saw, you know, life from a different lens and um, the love he gave my parents uh, it's very rare that you know uh, people are able to share such a bond with a guru that it's two ways you know how to love each other and uh, the only time I see I really saw my parents cry was when Abbaji passed away which was 22 years ago and uh, so much of love he blessed our family with that it's really hard for me to put all this in words and I, I miss him very much and I love him very much and love you also very much and thank you for having uh, accepted me and my parents as a part of this family uh, for almost uh, three and a half decades now so I'm very mm -hmm. blessed thank you Zakir thank bhai you, yeah. for uh, thank you thank you for everything Nishi bhai you there are you there Awake. <laughs> Are you awake, Nishi Bhai? Or is that your photo? This is photo. <laughs> I guess that's his photo because he hasn't moved. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Tony Ji, you want to say something? These two days, uh, February 2nd and 3rd, <clears throat> I'm not going to, I'm not going to quibble about it. They're difficult. In this very room, Zakir Khaid called me to tell me that Razia very suddenly had passed away. When I went home a few hours later, Birwa, Fuzzle's wife, Birwa, called me to say that she was gone. So uh, for me, this, it's very emotional. And as Afsha has many times pointed out, how Wonderful that we've had the Barsi to get us through. Starting with, you know, waking up at 3 a.m. and getting to the theater at 6, spending all day, some first the first Barsi's into the night. But I want to thank you, my family. I, I count myself very fortunate to have you as my family. Abaji gave me so much love in my life. Um, he just expands to me as a treasure. I, I dream about him. Um, I know that <clears throat> you do too. Um, that he went with Razia is a, a great mystery, but perhaps a blessing that they're together. We don't know these things. We give them to, we give them to God. But I want to give my most reverent pranam to all of you and say how much I yes. love you and how grateful I am for all of you and for everyone who's helped with the Barsi over the years, all of the musicians, artists, the, uh, the volunteers, the people who help make it happen, and of course the audience, everyone who loves Abaji. I have so many stories about Abaji, but I won't take a lot of time now. He was sometimes like a big child. I would see him with the grandkids. I remember him peering over the kids' shoulders when they were little and always playing cards. And he wanted to be included. And then finally he was. And he, he, he was a very loving dada and nana. 
and his face would light up when we walked into the house. When we walked into Simla House, a budgie's face lit up. When, when I, I walked in with Anissa and Bella from California, he gave us so much love. And all of the students here, all around the world, my goodness, the, the influence that he's been, it's inestimable. And it just becomes more precious. So again, Pranam, thank you so much, everybody. So wonderful to see you. Miss everybody so much. Thank you all very much. And I hope very soon we'll be able to see each other in person. Inshallah. You know, Inshallah. Thank you so much, touch Dr. each Dr. other. Tony Bobby, for making this possible. And to everybody out there, you know, 